Magkano yung kinita natin nung unang time na ayong nagbenta ng t-shirt? Well, roughly uh, since ma- mga last year around 150 actually, 150k. 150k. I have probably mentioned in some of my videos before na meron akong t-shirt business back in college before but I never told anyone your story on how it all started and in this video, I'll share to you that story and hopefully by the end of this video, you start executing on your ideas. It all started when I feel so mad sa isang professor ko and feeling ko lahat na nangyayari sa akin is mali. So I wanted to earn some money para baibalik ko yung self-esteem ko sa sarili ko and wala akong idea kung paano ko yung gagawin. All I just want is to earn some money. So I started talking to my friends about yung idea ko na gusto ko mag-earn ng money and it's like shouting to the universe ko na yung gusto mo mangyari until it manifest. So I have this friend, his name is Francis at kaklasmate ko siya sa lahat ng mga major subjects ko and nung nabanggit ko sa kanya yung idea ko, sabi niya, sakto, meron daw siyang friend who has an idea of selling t-shirts. So, in-introduce niya ako dun sa friend niya yun, which is si Mike, which I became very good friends with. And naalala ko yung pinakaunang meeting namin. It was in a communications laboratory. And dun sila, kasi sila yung ano eh, mga student assistant dun. So, yung unang meeting namin, napag-usapan namin na sobrang gigil na gigil akong start yung idea ni Mike. Kasi matagal niya ng idea yon. After that conversation, akala ko wala na mangyayari dun sa idea niyang yon, And magiging drawing na lang. Kasi after 3 months, hindi niya pa rin kami binabalikan about that idea. It took 3 months bago ko ulit marinig si Mike. And sinabihan niya na kami ni Francis na meron na siyang plano. And this is how it goes. So si Mike, member siya ng org. And yung org niya plans to do some fundraising activity via selling t-shirts. Sakto, di ba? So, yun. Uh, nung narinig niya yun, nag-offer na siya dun sa org niya na kami na yung magsusupply sa kanila ng t-shirt para dun sa fundraising activity nila. And from that, we've got a deal and sobrang saya namin nun. Just when you thought na the story will go smoothly, you are wrong. Wala kami idea kung paano namin gagawin yung t-shirt business na to. All we have is yung common sense na kailangan mo na design para dun sa t-shirt mo kailangan mo ng supplier ng t-shirt and kailangan mo magpiprint ng design sa t-shirt mo. Let me insert a funny story before tayo mag-proceed on how we make this business work. So, kailangan mo na introduce yung new character. His name is Glenn and originally, siya yung ano, friend ni Francis and ni Mike. Sila talaga yung magkakaibigan ever since. Kaya lang, I came at the right moment and na ko yung position niya that would make this business start. So, yung pinaka-role ni Glenn dito is we need some capital to start producing shirts. So, nag-usap-usap kami ni Mike at ni Francis kung magkano yung kailangan namin ilabas na capital para makapag-start kami mag-produce ng shirts. So, yung napag-usapan namin is 2,100. Kasi yun yung kailangan namin para mabili lahat ng size ng shirts para may pang-size yung customer namin. And ito naman si Francis, wala siyang kapera-pera. So, yung TIG 700 na capital namin, inutang niya muna yung sa kanya kay Glenn. So, bumili kami ng pang-sizes namin dun sa Juan Luna sa Divisoria. And what we did is nagpa-print lang kami dun sa mga nag-heat press dun ng isang design. So, bali, bumalik kami sa school, may isa lang kaming t-shirt na may design. And what we did was to ask yung mga customers namin na mag-down payment for pre-order. And yung down payment nila, yun yung ginamit namin pang capital to produce more shirts. Dahil doon, we are able to solve yung problem namin with capital. And hindi na namin kailangan maglabas ng money, so akala namin wala na kaming problema. But boy, we are so wrong. Remember yung unang t-shirt uh, design namin, it is via heat press. It is a temporary solution to our problem kasi yung majority ng production namin hindi pwedeng via heat press kasi masyadong mahal yung heat press and wala kaming kikitain. So we already have yung pera ng mga customers namin pero wala kaming supplier na makapag-deliver sa kailangan namin. And it took us 3 very painful weeks before namin masolve tong problem na to. Kasi kailangan muna namin ng sample from our supplier before we give them yung go signal to do bulk productions. And it took them a week para lang makapag-produce ng sample. Sobrang na-delay talaga yung production namin at this time. Yung unang dalawang supplier na pinuntahan namin, palpak yung sample nila. And noong mga panahong to, parang sobrang pasuko na ako na gusto ko nalang ibalik dun sa mga nag-pre-orders namin clients. Yung pera nila, and sa aming tatlo kasi, ako yung weakest emotionally. But suddenly, it works. Third time sa charm, sabi nga nila. Yung third supplier namin was able to deliver a sample na kagaya dun sa heat press na sample namin 
and boom, yun, okay na. Nasolve na namin problem namin doon. And we already give them yung go signal to do mass production. And yun, because of that, uh, nakadeliver kami dun sa mga clients namin. And for the org, nakapag-raise ng funds. And for us, dun, kasi sa aming tatlo, we're able to make profit. And yun, because of that, everybody wins. What I learned from that experience is just to put yourself out there and sabihin mo sa mundo kung ano yung gusto mo mangyari. Kasi parang that's the only way na it will manifest eh. Pero in time, hindi naman siya yung uh, biglang mangyayari. But it will happen pagka ginawa mo yun. And second is, uh, take some risk, have some guts, execute your idea. And yung worst thing naman na mangyayari is mag-fail ka lang. And parang it's all worth it para sa akin. So yun lang. Hope you have, you've got something valuable in this uh, episode. Peace. Bye. Okay. na. Sige, yung ano, parang idadagdag ko dun sa video ko kung ano, magkano yung kinita natin nung unang time na ayong nagbenta ng t-shirt. Yung unang term. Oh, unang term? Ah, uh, unang term. Yun yung pinakamalaki. Well, roughly, uh, since ma- mga roughly around 50, 150, actually, 150k. 150k. Yung kinita natin for first term, di ba? First term, first oh, time. Ilang, Mismo. Pero may halong swerte din yun eh, no? Yun yung pinakamalaki, the rest, pababa na eh. Pero, astig eh. Actually, that, tataas pa nga yun dahil meron pa tayong pwedeng ibenta na eh. Pero, since na naging successful yung unang batch, tinuloy ulit natin. So, parang, eh, di ba? Oo. Uh, ito yung parang... Tinamit natin yung pera pang bili ulit ng ano. Eh, wala naman tayong ilalabas na pera nun kasi naka ano eh. naka pre-order yung na- best. Oh naman, ang daya talaga, ang daya talaga nung ganung strategy pero effective. Uh, yung next kong tanong, magkano o kaya yung kinita natin uh, all throughout yung mapuwa career natin sa pagbebenta ng t-shirt? Lahat-lahat ah. Tingin mo magkano yung uh, each or sige, yung each or, na lang. Kasi malamang sa malamang parehas lang tayo ng kinita eh. Kasi divided by Divided, divided by 3, divided by 2 pa naman. Halos kalimang beses din tayo lang, di ba? Oo. Oh. Tingin mo, hindi ko na matandaan. Umabot ba ng 100? Nakatig, nakatig 100 ba tayo? Total, ah? I guess so. Oh. Talaga? Tingin ka, oh. Kasi, bayad ako ng tuition ko, pre. Ah, ano kapag bayad ka ba ng sarili mong tuition? Oo. Oh. Ah, okay. Tindi mo, ah. Kala ko pinang... Kala ko pinang... Kala ko, ano, pinangpunta mo dyan sa Japan yung iba? Hindi. <laughs> y- yung iba, nilagay ko lang sa ipon ko, pero uh, nagamit ko rin yung combined situation. Plus, yung mga emergency expenses, nagamit ko rin Hmm. Ayun lang. <laughs> ano, okay ka na? Okay na ako. Salamat. Gaingat dyan, ha? <laughs> Okay, yeah, thank you. Wala nang ano, ano, topic mo ngayon, pre. Hindi, yung parang ano, uh, starting a profitable ano, business in uh, business in college, ganun. Parang kung paano mag-start ng business in college. Parang kikwento ko lang yung story kung paano tayo nakapag-start nung ano, t-shirt business natin. Nori mo, upload ko siya this Saturday o kaya Sunday. <laughs> okay, okay, good luck. Sige, thank you. Thank you. Bye-bye.